let's talk about your illusions of happiness on social media. So, you sit there and just scroll through pics after picture. People enjoying sunny days, going off on tremendous adventures, closer to home. Loads of pictures are posted of people on nights out and everybody seems a socialite. Except you. Dragging you down, anxiety can build and questions start arising in your head. Why not me? Why can I not have that? Their life is so perfect. But is it really? How can you know that from one moment captured from the lens of a camera? Do you really know the people in those pictures have gone through life so easily as you perceive and never experience hardship? Is the girl taking selfies of her mouth-watering food while in the background the tide rolls up on an exotic beach really fully happy? For all you know, she sacrificed countless hours of the year just to go on a two-week break so that life can feel worthwhile. How does anybody know the countless times she's walked down dark roads, dark paths and experienced horrendous suffering? Yes, a picture tells a thousand words, but when has ever a thousand words told the whole story? Let's take the guy at every party, life and soul, pictured with so many people around him. How do we know that he's really happy? Could he, in fact, consider himself in the mirror every night and hate what he sees? Surrounded by so many friends, how do you know he's not curled up at home every night, crippled with loneliness? Personal connection, feeling as distant as bright stars on a cold, bitter night. If you were to look at my Facebook, it might appear that I'm this happy-go-lucky guy, globe-trotting around the world while loving life, jumping out of planes, taking selfies with kangaroos partying until I can't do it anymore and crazy enough to jump off a bridge with a bungee cord. What I didn't show you, however, was those dark days when worthlessness towered over me, self-doubt besieged me, when dark clouds refused to shift and attacking myself daily whittled away all hope. Why? Because I wanted to present my best side. And that's what everybody does. They present their best side. And there is absolutely nothing wrong with that. We all do it. Listen, I'm not preaching to you in hope that you will stop posting those great pictures. Please keep sharing those amazing moments of your life that inspire us and make us wonder what could be. But neither am I encouraging you to become a martyr by disclosing all the bad times that you experience. If you wish to do that, I salute you and praise you for your bravery. The point I'm trying to make is, why are you creating this illusion of happiness and social, on social media and measuring it against your own happiness? Please stop looking at those pictures and feeling down because you think everybody else is happy. See those pictures for what they are. One moment just 1,000 words of a massive chronicle of stories that is a person's life. Let me tell you, happiness was never achieved without periods of unhappiness. Everybody goes through hard times. This perception of perfection that all of you are having will only make it harder for you. Stop those depressive feelings pushing you further in that quagmire of misery. Instead, use those images and pictures to spark your desire and fuel your enthusiasm for the life that you want. That life that you want is waiting for you. If you would just believe in yourself and take it and stop falling into the trap of thinking everybody else is in a better position than you. And even if they are, do something about it. Your life is waiting for you.
go live it. Did you just like that video and want to join us on our next adventure? Please hit that subscribe button. If you just like this video, please give us a like. We're on Instagram where you can get all the behind the scenes footage and pictures. So please follow us. You can also now follow us on Facebook. So hit that like button. Thank you very much for watching. Take care and goodbye.